who has never suffered any flight delay? Could we use the causes of these issues to avoid bad flights? ATAD tried to answer some of these questions. We believe that many flights are delayed by meteorological incidents, but we believe there are other reasons of anomalies such as the plane, the airport, or the road. We also are interested to know if plane changes its typical flight path in order to detect a possible security breach. This first stage was focused on analyzing flights between LA and New York, assessing the flight path and to detect abnormal movements in flight in relation to its geoposition and heading. We got two different features in our app. The first one allows us to view the history of flights and find anomalous points detected by NewPick. Let's see what NewPick says about this flight. Here we are going to select the date of the flight and we can pick another one just to compare them. Um, using this you can uh, show the anomaly points on the flight path. And below there are two different charts. This is for the uh, last flight path selected and this one will compare both flights. But we also want to detect if any current flight is having an anomaly. So we can inform the airline about this situation. To do this, we create a map having real-time data. It will notify the user if it finds any anomaly. To access real-time feature, we are going to click here. To get real-time data, you just need to click here, and you will start getting data from the server. So we are using uh, this threshold to detect uh, and alert any kind of anomaly. So no big detected what anomaly point here and this is showing the alert um, so we can know that this is something that uh, was never seen before. We know that there are thousands of flights above our heads every day. One problem we noticed is that scalability for this kind of system is crucial. Because of this, we built HTM Moklu. By definition, it's short for Hierarchical Temporal Memory Models Cluster. Moklu provides a platform similar to HTM Engine for Java applications and has the ability to scale horizontally using multiple servers. Then we built our app on top of Moklu. That way we can add hardware on demand to deal with tons of data for real-time flights. On the UI side, we are using AngularJS that integrate with Leaftree and Comet Actors, a Google Maps Angular implementation called Angular Google Maps and D3 charts. The backend is built using two different web servers. One of them is used to connect to the models cluster, get and push new flights data coming from external sources. Also, it saves results into MongoDB. The second web server is used to serve this data to the client. Both web servers can be scaled horizontally. A lot of value can be delivered by ATAD in the short term future such as give the possibility to a person who is about to buy a ticket 
to select a flight not only based on cost and benefits, but also for the possibility of having a fault, making the travel experience better. Find which airports have more anomalies than others in order to provide this information for later use by airlines or passengers. Report on the number of anomalies by flight to assess their personal on board. Add weather information to understand the impact and help plan situation where airports are closed to prevent early collapse of secondary airport facilities like hotels. Analyze roads and airports can enable airlines to enhance their roads management in order to reduce costs generated by anomalies. We believe this information is useful for all stakeholders, but primarily for the passenger, who will receive a better travel experience.